What up, Internet? Your amigo Nico here at Cliff Jones RV in Sealy, Texas. Today we have our smallest toy hauler. It's the 2023 Forest River Wolf Pup 18 RJB. This RV is 22 feet, 9 inches total length and weighs about 3,700 pounds empty. So on the front here, we have a two inch ball. You do have a manual tongue jack. Our service department can upgrade that to an electric jack or really easy and cost efficient way to get the same effect. You used to use a drill and a three quarter inch bit. It'll raise and lower this quick jack here. We do have a propane tank in the front at Cliff Jones. We have no hidden freight charges, no hidden make ready charges. We make sure that the propane's filled up, ready to go. This RV does include the juice pack built in solar from the factory. So the battery and solar panel are pre-installed. Starting out in the front right over here, this is gonna be your main storage on the outside. Full-size spare tire is included. Right over here, we have a ghost light as well. This Cherokee symbol will display at night and early in the morning whenever it's darker outside. We also have a large electric awning as well with blue LED lights. These also match the lights that are in the marine grade speakers. So you can play music just inside, just outside, or both. We also have a TV mount here as well, power and coaxial as well. This is gonna be the main entrance into the RV. If you see here, it has a tempered glass door. It looks really great. And another advantage of the tempered glass door is that you also have a window here. If you want extra privacy, we can also add a thin shade that we have available in parts as well. Here we have a screen door with an easy access latch so you can open the main door while keeping this one closed. And then also want to point out that this is a friction hinge door as well. It'll hold itself open in moderate wind. You don't have to worry about those plastic latches and as on more affordable RVs. We also have the more ride step above steps as well. They're super secure. The feet touch the ground when you have it set up properly so there's no give. Whenever you're ready to travel, they just fold right into the door like so. It has a little latch here to hold it in place. And then you can press these buttons here to raise and lower the steps. We also have an extra large door handle as well. It's got three different folding positions. It makes it really easy for people of all ages to get in and out. Right over here on the tires. Now this is a single axle with the Wolf Pup. They are all single axles, but it has 15 inch off-road tires for better towability. Coming down right here, we also have a leech latch to keep your four-legged friends along tethered nearby. Here we have the patio set up as well. If you want to drop it down and load up your toys, it's really simple. All you have to do is pull the pin here that holds the cable on each side. It will go down, move the patio doors out of the way, and you can drive right up. Here on the back as well, we also have the LED tail light. It's super bright, so you can see what's going on behind your camper. And then we also have a backup camera included as well, which is a $1,000 value. Backup cameras can save lives. And then we also have these tent screens as well to keep bugs out if you want to get cross ventilation on a day like today. This is going to be one of the vents here for fuel fumes. So just keep this one open, keep the other one open and it'll vent all that out for motorcycles and ATV stuff like that. We do have stabilizers on each corner as well. Here we have the intake and exhaust for the furnace. We also have a convenience slide outside as well. So you can see early in the morning and late at night. This is going to be the termination point here for the gray tank, sink and shower, black tank for the toilet as well. So you just need one hose. And speaking of hoses, we also have a holder for your sewer hose right underneath there as this RV does not have a bumper because it's a toy hauler. This RV is 30 amp power. So this is gonna be your main power in. We also have a hot cold shower on the outside as well. This is gonna be city water for continuous water. Just make sure you use a water pressure regulator. And then it also has a fresh tank on board as well. So if you wanna get water off grid, the 12 volt pump inside will work on the panel and the battery. And then here we have the tankless water heater. That's a $3,000 value. As long as you have propane, you'll always have hot water. So here we are inside the 18 RJB. This is gonna be the garage slash living room slash kitchen. So up to the bathroom wall here, you're gonna have about 122 inches of length. And then up to the bed, you're gonna have about 167. Right over here, we have the 12 cubic foot all electric fridge. Pulls down much faster than propane electric fridges and offers you anywhere from two to four additional cubic feet of space. With the solar included, it has a battery disconnect right here. So if you store your RV, just turn it off. Your battery won't deplete as fast. Here we have a safety device. Here we have the breaker box and fuses as well. Here we have the kitchen, everything you need and more. Residential power microwave to very quickly and evenly heat food. A range hood that actually works. This will vent outside while you're cooking on the two burner cooktop. 
ours is recessed with a extra glass insert here to give you more counter space. And then it also folds back to act as a backsplash. Here we have blue built-in night lights. And then we also have the furnace right here as well that operates off of propane. So it'll keep it nice and warm in this 18 foot interior. Here we have the sink. It's a one piece undermount stainless steel sink, much more sanitary than plastic. Overhead storage here. Here we have the voltage meter for the solar panel. It shows you exactly where your battery is. AM, FM radio. It also has Bluetooth. You can play music just inside, just outside or both. And then we also have the super window here in the kitchen as well. So you can enjoy your views from here. And then we also have two large windows on this side as well on the camping side. Here we can see all the tie downs. This is going to be the wheel well. More tie downs over there. So in this coach, you can sleep up to four. This is the dinette in the bed mode. It's super easy to convert. All these cushions will just pull right off. And so now we have it ready for seating. This table is freestanding. You can move it wherever you want. It also has Velcro to hold it in place as well. And then if you want to convert it into a table, just goes up like that and locks in place. We'll set this over here. And then right over here on the dinette as well, we have USB, regular power. Here's that vent we were talking about. It just slides, slides forward like that. And then here we have the patio area. This is super simple to break down. You can just slip it right open, remove the pins, so it'll go right down. And then back on the inside, we have overhead storage here as well. And then right above here, we have the Coleman Mach 13,500 BTU AC. It'll keep it super cool in this Wolf Pup. Here we have the mount for the TV. This is gonna be the connection for the onboard antenna for local channels. If you turn it off, you're on onboard entertainment. Power above. This is gonna be the other vent for the fuel fumes here. And then we also have the Cherokee total control panel. It is backlit. You can see where all your tanks are, where your battery's at. Control the electric awning, your lights as well power here and then this is going to be the bathroom it is a dry bath toilet is separate from the shower it does have a fan it gives you a little bit more headroom you can also get cross ventilation as well if you go ahead and open it up and turn it on another great thing about this bathroom is that the shower has a full tub shroud to protect the walls from moisture we have a built-in sink here so you can brush your teeth and shave in here versus doing so in the kitchen and then we also have the tankless water heater thermostat right here so all you have to do is turn it on select your temperature and that has an animation that shows you when it's working. And then right above, we have the main bed. This is a East West Camper Queen bed, one of the most popular RV bed sizes. You have a little shelf there, lights, and then we have this bunk above that can be used for sleeping or extra storage. And then this does fold up as well so you can get to the outside storage. So here's the 2023 Wolf Pup 18 RJB. We have it in stock. If you have a lightweight truck or SUV, this is a perfect toy hauler floor plan. We have it in stock in Sealy, best prices and best service. 